Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Plays Lightning Returns. Today, I guess we're going near the Sacred Gate. Wherever the hell that is. Up there. Okay. There's a telepad up there. That requires me going over there. But apparently I can go to the lower level? Shot of hope. Ooh. I mean, dog. What? Why are you even asking me that? You know I have all the tablets. You were there when I got them. Where is here? Oh, it's another crux. I hear... I hear something. Oh, this is goblet, dudes. Calm down. Weirdos. Where is here? Oh, did I open this door by accident? I guess so. We gotta find our way back to that telepath so we can just teleport to the sacred gate. On the downside of that, I don't know where the hell we are. We were just here a minute ago. I do need to kill you. I'm sorry. Oh uh, yeah, just straight up sorry, but I need some of your shards for a quest. I, I don't feel right about this either. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. You were just standing there. You didn't even aggro me yet. Now you're dead. Weird long cat pot thing. Thank you for the shard, though. Sup, dog? Oh, it's another one. Oh, don't do that hissing thing. That just makes that just makes me feel awful. Kind of wish we could just buy these bar shards somewhere. I like your glowing eyes. The show is over. Ah, I get it because the whole the garb thing. Good one. We might actually be able to get all these little things this uh, day. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, there's a telepad. Oh, he f oh, you got me, dick. <laughs> I was about to say, wow, we actually uh, were able to get through that without actually getting hit by them. But no. Mr. Belcher here had to go Belcher on me. Ow! I'm actually surprised that did anything to me. You got him, Fang? I got it. You do, like, so little damage. Alright, where is this bad Larry? Alright, how's it going? Uh, Sacred Gate. Never did find that, uh... Way to that other switch, huh? That way? Hi, who are you? I always dreamed of becoming a bandit. Now I wonder why I ever waited so long. Because you had other dreams and desires and, you know, probably other hobbies at the time. You were probably smarter back then, too. Oh, is this it? Sure. The lost mural, huh? And this will give us the key we need to open the sacred gate. And we can finally reach the clevis. I'm assuming there's gonna be like a boss encounter then. Huh? At some point. Maybe hell, maybe I'm gonna have to fight Fang. What's that? If it isn't the man himself, the order's idol, Benevelza, god of light. Death defiles the soul. Let salvation purify you. What does that mean? So the dead are unclean, is that what they think? And when Vanille performs the soul song, those bastards are going to make everything neat and tidy. Doesn't make any goddamn sense. What do you mean? Don't you know? It's the ceremony that the Order's got planned. It's the reason they want the Holy Clevis. Is that a red mage? So Vanille can do their dirty work. Thing is, she's the only one who can hear the dead. And the Clavis can draw the souls of the dead. Isn't that how it goes? So, what does the ceremony do? More than just summon the dead, I take it? If you believe the Order, it's all putting the dead to rest and providing a salve for their tortured souls. That was enough for Vanille. Hook, line, and sinker. Well, I just don't know what... She says that she has to go... It means that the dead are the defiled or something like that. Past. So it's what Vanille wants, this ceremony. 
But even knowing that, you have no intention of helping the Order? <laughs> Not in this lifetime. So if you're dead, you're defied. I don't get that. It's, it's a natural thing. Okay. Thank you for the crux base. Right. This should complete the crux. Let's try it on the sacred gate. Come on. The clevis waits. Sure, I am totally gonna actually like save again before we even try to touch that door. Just in case there's like some unbeatable boss in there. Well, I mean Oh, okay. Oh, so the time has actually come to open this door. How do you know that? Did you read the script? Okay, let's try this. I saved just in case. I wish I haven't had a trouble with the, open, like a boss boss yet, have I? Just random boss. encounters. And who knows what else? I wouldn't be letting your guard down just yet. <laughs> like I need reminding. How long do you think I've been out here in the desert? At least three days. Two of them waiting for me. I'm picking up a huge energy source from within the sacred gate. It's just like Fang said, the clavis lies before you. It's close. It may have further protections, though. Be careful out there, Lance. Great. <laughs> Why does everything have to have further protections? I'm just gonna quickly check for, like, treasure. No, 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 no. I don't even try that crap right now, game. Uh, I didn't do anything. Oh, okay. Just, finally made just it. saying. Yeah, we've don't go and spawn dodge. anything on me no just yet. Go but forward now. I mean, nothing. You can go back Dude. as well. Hello. You're very glowy. Oh, it's a clock! Oh, I get it! 13! 13, 13 hour! Number 13! The number of the so beast! That's the Holy Clevis. The magic box that'll bring together all the souls of the dead. You know... I don't know what I expected the thing to look like, but a box was not it. Is that what Clavis means? I kind of thought it was going to be like some sort of like cross. Like kind of but force. even then, I wasn't sure. There's no question. That artifact is definitely emitting powerful energy. No human could have made this. Not without divine help. Either that or the gods themselves made it. Dope. Hope, fill us in. What's happening? <sighs> it's the seculars. They're close. And they're on. Oh, well, they're gonna die. They must have been hiding in the chaos. It's fine. No, what? Goodbye. You just said that they were... It's like seculars of all Sorry about this, Vanille. Huh, Fang! Huh. This is what you've been looking for. I'm not letting anyone else have it. If Vanille uses this damn thing, she'll die. Oh. What do you mean? Okay. This thing. It's a bloody curse. How do you know that? Yeah, purify the dead. Put them to their eternal rest. All it'll take is the life of a saint. Vanille is dead set on going through with it. She'll martyr herself to the past and then... <laughs> oh, those guys are easy. No, that didn't work. You have done an admirable job. The sacred one Kill him. must be pleased. Allow us to thank you on her behalf. What the hell? The hell is that? You call her the sacred one. But you're the ones who want her to die. That ceremony is not gonna happen. Season, you insult the order of salvation, and in doing so, you blaspheme our almighty God. Oh, boo-hoo! This thing is creepy looking. I think that's the plan? You wanna lend me a hand? You're asking now? Let's do it, Fang! I mean, you probably should have told us this on the, like, the start of this, but alright. Okay, protective circle. That sucks. 
The spell? Man, the spell never works. All right, well, thanks for the poison. Um, wind. Wait, what was that? Unleash physical attack when the enemy is protected with a barrier. The effect is greater when the enemy is using seance. Unleash physical attack when the enemy's barrier has fallen. I'm gonna think. I'm gonna assume wind staggers it. The shame that we didn't have enough there. Breath of Rancor. Oh, we staggered the hell out of it. No way, I want her in peril. Oh, wait a minute, what the hell? Oh, never mind. Yeah, do that. Yeah, oh yeah, just keep doing that. Oh, that's actually lovely. Why would I dispel that? I kinda wish I had more ATB, of course. Cronus, you say that every fight. I know! And it never changes. I want more ATB. Yeah, you know me. Ow. Deep Protect Hunter, huh? What are you doing? I don't know what you're doing. Here, have some Arrowa. You have, like, things on you that I'm not a fan of. Hellcraft? No, keep that on. That's probably magic, so I should probably, like, you know, die, I guess. I didn't die, but still. Okay, we good? We're good. Uh, Arrowa? Keep arrowing? Or you can launch me. That's fine, too. I would like some more arrow, please. Please. There we go. In peril. You protect. Go to town. Oh, you're gonna defaith me? Oh, what are you, an idiot? Man, I'm not gonna lie, that's actually very good damage there. Alright, so. I'm thinking. Go. There we go. Do more damage. We're doing alright. Really wish I had more ATB. Chrono, shut up. I'm sorry. <laughs> but it's true! I mean, I have that ether, right? I want to save that, though. I was thinking, you know, use an overclock. But at the same time, overclock's kind of powerful, right? Yeah, I mean, it is. I really got nothing else to say about that. It's like stupidly strong. A little, little bit too strong. Um, being said, though, I'm not afraid to use it when I need to. But using it on um, snow last time kind of... I wouldn't say scared me off of it. It, uh... Looking back through editing, I was like, man. That was a little much. But, you know, if I need to in the future, I'll use it again. Now save that. Wait for the blue bar to get up. Booyah. There we go. We come in here in peril. And then hit him with a... Uh, I guess hit him with a... A stun attack? What the hell? Did you just blow me back? You did. You're a dick. You're not exactly hard. But you're kind of annoying. You're also, I like, think, kind of, like, dead? Well, no, you're not, because you're being an ass. Yeah, that's about right. Nope. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I need to use some Phoenix Downs. I'm back, bitch. You're dead. 
Grendel. Two stars? That's about right. You drop any? No? Okay. Well, that was harder than snow. About being, I would say the same difficulty as... No. Though I don't even think I got a star on Noel. What's the deal with the clavis? What does it really do? Doesn't it ease the dead suffering? <sighs> oh, it eases it all right. See, they get Vanille to summon the souls from out of the chaos with the clavis, then destroy them. No more soul, no more suffering. Yeah, this is one way to they look at it. Destroy them all? Does Vanille understand what she's doing? She knows it, just like she knows it'll kill her. And she just goes on saying she's got to do it. I, I guess she that's one the only way of way to stop the cry she hears. The only way to save them. <sighs> yeah. And you didn't want to let her die like that, so you tried to get the clavis yourself. Yeah, that was the plan. I mean, I wouldn't want to live hearing the voice of the dead for the rest of my life. Her, to keep it from her, I knew what would happen if the order got it. Vanille would kill herself for a lie. So I joined up the bandits here, and watched over the ruins. And as long as no one found it, I could leave well enough alone. Now you see why I came along with you? I had to make sure that the Savior wouldn't hand the Clavis over to the Order. I didn't even trust an old friend like you. I mean, you should have told me. That's low. Hi, Lumina. I doubted your old pal Lightning, spying on her like she was going to stab you in the back. But I guess it's not so different from the way I spied on you. I had to wait forever to tip those guys off. Who? Oh, you're the one. The seconders. The seconders to us. Exactly, and without hope even noticing a thing. Now the order has their little clavis, and they're beating a trail back to Luxarian. I can't wait to see that ceremony. Can you? All those useless souls purified forever in return for Vanille's life. Even the soul that was once Sarah wiped away like it never existed. Huh. When does the ceremony take place? It'll happen on the last day of the world. When the final bells start to toll across the land, Vanille will face the clavis and begin the soul song. <sighs> so we're gonna- are you summoning a monster right now? Oh, okay. Thank you? Huh? Bye. So is that Vanille. what we're doing? Vanille is going to die. You never did mince words. And I can't save her. So, what's your point? I save souls by granting them what they wish for. If Anil wishes for death with all her heart, then I have to let her have it. I have no choice. You're saying you'd let her die? I mean, I'm saying you don't have a yes, choice. If she doesn't change her mind. I can't do it for her. You are the only one who knows how she feels. The only one who can save her from her darkness. I mean, she's hearing the voices of the dead. Have been. That's gotta pay like a toll on your mental state, right? All right, all right. I get it. I get it, Vanille. You hear me? We're in this together until the very end. So we're going to stop that, right? Before the final day. Is that like... Uh, the Dead Dunes main quest completed. Um, hmm. Okay. I mean, I get, I get it from, like, Vanille's standpoint, too. Like, hearing voices of the dead is probably not good. Like, ever? Um... I could see wanting to destroy the souls as a way of, if they are constantly suffering, to end their suffering, but for mystery, mystery of the Holy Clavis. I'm just going to assume, though, that, that that's probably actually not why they're going to do that. Preta? Preta? Hood? Okay. Are you still in my group? So, the Secutors snuck their way in here after us thanks to Lumina. Yeah? I 
learned about the Soul Song, the real truth of it, back when I was with the Order in Luxurian. They wanted us to think it was this great thing, gonna save the dead. But then I learned that it would kill Vanille. Why didn't you try to run away together? I wanted to. Believe me, I tried reason, guilt, even brute force. Uh, Vanille is probably the strongest person in the world. She, give an inch. she said she was going to do it, whether it killed her or not. This is still about her trying to atone for the past. Uh, even the power she has to hear the dead. She thinks it's God trying to punish her. I mean, dude, if you hear constant voices in your head, maybe. I found out the truth about the soul song. In the end, I completely lost it. It's not easy to watch someone go to their death, and willingly. When she saw me yelling and raging, though, I think she just dug her heels in even harder. Well, I, I mean, it was like well, she no, she's not a kid. Right before me, and I couldn't stop it. She's like twenty, right, or something like that. Mean? I mean, okay, she's like a thousand and twenty, but still. Forget it. She is childish, though. Do you remember what I said before about Vanille slipping away right before me? Why? Ready to talk about it? I guess I am. You see, the reason she's so wound up for that ceremony is our past. You mean her guilt over the past has made her willing to die? Worse than that, I think. It's not so much that Vanille is prepared to die in order to atone for the past. She's not just willing. It's like she wants to die. As though it's a crime to be alive. Hmm. When I looked at her, I could see it in her face. She thought she ought to die. She thinks it's still. That's a shift so in personality with her. her life because she feels I feel like, anyways. In cocoon or whatever. But who really benefits from that? All it does is end another life. It doesn't bring anyone back. This is true. Why are you telling me this? Shouldn't you be talking to I her? I'm feeling like she already did. Listen to you. The savior, eh? Don't need to be told twice. Are you in my party still? No. Okay, just checking. We already yes. Thank you. I want to go check out that accessory we just got. Thank you. Quest. What do we got here? Main quest. We're we're done. Oh god. Okay. Well, I was gonna go back there after. That. Well, maybe. I don't want to go back to that temple. <laughs> It has scarred me. Or is it? Pretty her uh, hood. Uh, increases magic resistance by 75%. So it's the opposite of the ghostly hood. Okay, so if I run into an enemy that does a massive amount of magic damage, I guess I can just throw this on. Shame I can't equip both of them. But, you know, makes sense, right? I guess I could have two tank... No, 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 no. Two tanking classes, which would be kind of a... Horrible. It would be actually horrible. Um, and slow as balls. So, we have like two hours left, right? Uh, I was told that there was like something here. I guess I could have just left here, right? I went outside. It's been real lightning, but now it's time to go our separate ways. Okay. <laughs> Got it. Hey, next time I'm in the desert, you won't see me. The gang's officially disbanded. Oh. I've got somewhere else I need to be. Sounds like we have a date in Luxarian. Good luck, Fang. See you at the end of the world. Okay. So, end of the world, we go to Luxarian. Fair enough. Hi, Fang. Am I, am I still teleporting? Uh, I'll take that as a yes. Yeah, there's somewhere, I think uh, they said north of the town, where I could fight a lot of niblets. Something like that. And where though? Here or I think it's in the warehouse. It might be in the warehouse district. Actually, I have to go check that comment, but I guess I can do that in between episodes. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press like below. If you're not subscribed yet, when you have my video section, check out some of the content, see if you're liking. And if you're into watching me live stream on twitch.tv slash give my channel a follow to be notified when I go live. Either way, thanks for watching. Hope you all have a great day.